Hello my friends and welcome to a new video for Infinity Kingdom. This is Biakian, official voice officer. And we're back again for the Prime League. We are in season 4 right now. And I'm playing in server 73, Alliance Puns. And we are going to enter for the current position, the semi-finals. Let me show you here the diagram which we played the last week or sorry, this week, uh, this week the last matchup. It was between... Uh, Pons here versus 260. 260 is a sub alliance for sexy as fuck. This is server 170. And we have in the same day, sexy as fuck has took over Art of War Alliance uh in the main red alliance for server 38. While in the other side here we have fam is a sub red alliance for server 38. Is going to face SSQ um i'm not sure whether ssq is going to drop for fam because fam is a sub alliance for art of war or ssq is going to face the winner from the next week here so this is going to be held for the next sunday as a sub uh sorry as a semi-final and also we are going to face 170. i'm going to show you some of the highlights of our matchup versus 170 the match was so difficult guys it wasn't so easy at all it wasn't easy it wasn't fun because it was intense fights uh, from tower to tower from central to uh, sub towers and holding towers for as long as possible so uh, gladly we entered the game with kinda full participants 29 participants uh, both sides here for the first minute we are going to be four participants in uh the uh like in the couple of minutes uh here uh we entered the four participants and there are going to be four participants in less than five minutes so uh, we have some uh, relocations for the central tower in the both sides we have also for tower one uh, sorry tower two this is our home tower we have dandy and their home tower they have uh, ryuji ibl and they have lots of numbers at tower one tower one was so difficult to gain uh, for our side and also tower four i reached here as tower four alongside with our friends we kept uh, doing some attacks let me just uh, hide here the information we kept doing some attacks it was so difficult for us to obtain this tower tower four uh, for the first 10 minutes we kept fighting each other we kept losing members and they kept losing members we kept trying to change our relocations when we lose uh, members we try to uh, like use some relocations here and also they try to put relocations as well the member that tries to land a good relocation is going to have a more advantage so right now after 10 minutes we have our home tower they have also their home tower and all of the other towers are unoccupied especially the central tower let me fast forward a little bit after 20 minutes uh we still have this tower unoccupied while they managed to take tower one but we managed to take central tower because we had more members at the central tower while we gave up for tower one we also called our members to retreat from tower one or change uh, when they get zeroed they change the direction from tower one to central tower or tower four uh speaking about tower four we managed to take tower four with the help of support support talents is super important to take towers especially when you are uh, under pressure of taking uh, or attacking some other castles uh, we try to keep relocating around towers like for example i started to be here and after that i started to move away then i started to get closer a uh, bit by bit you keep changing your relocations and changing your destination to reach some certain amount of the map when being weak or when being strong so after 23 as minutes into the game it was 25,000 violet points while we get 35 uh, violet uh, points per second while they get only 20 per second the amount here uh, violet points gap is not so high they can close this gap if they manage to take another tower so they managed to uh, like flank on tower 2 
but we defended tower 2 successfully. After 38 minutes into the game, we have two towers, tower 2 and tower 4, and we keep still having the central tower. The gap is still 20,000 points while there is only 20 minutes into the game. The game is super, super, super intense and lots of fights. I can show you lots of reports when this is ends. And we can see that the amount of uh, like troops here are low on most of the players. And we keep healing. I used tons of healing speed ups. I used tons of gems to recall my marsh and speed up my marsh. Uh, this is me trying to help the central tower. And we will manage uh, or we will not manage to keep this central tower for long. As you see here, we lost this central tower. So we had a fast call about getting all our members to tower 1 because there is an opening here at tower 1 with low players. Only two players defending this tower because we had lots of players defending the central tower. So uh, in minute 15 or after 51 minutes into the game, we managed to take this tower 1. Now we are holding three towers while they are holding one tower alongside with the central tower. We kept doing this pressure into the map and for this pressure into the map we are going to have a win over uh, 30,000 uh, points gap sorry almost 30,000 points gap it is 25,000 points gap between us 88,000 for us and 64 for them and this is how it ended for a victory for our side gg for uh puns and hard luck for 260 we are going to face the same scenario next Sunday uh, versus 170. And for the battle record, let me show you here some of uh, the reports we had versus 260. I used to play with my Fire Marsh with Energy Shield, Energy Suppression on Hippolyta, misleading also on Hippolyta. And on William, I'm using Fighting Will, Oaken Guard, Malice. And on Cyrus, I'm using No Escape weakness and assist on sign dude i'm using corrosive power and yielding and fighting master uh i i thought i had fighting master max level but i think i was playing with fighting master level one uh maybe i forgot to change this skill but it was doing uh, some good uh like it was doing what it was uh, built for because Fighting Master for me, I was just doing it to control the immunity. So the extra reduced damage is not a must for me. So the core element here is to keep playing in rallies. Doing solo attacks here will not uh, be perfect. While attacking maybe uh, versus defending is going to be uh, something uh, good. But the rallies is what is important. Doing uh, rallies with one member versus one uh, defender is a must because you don't want to lose lots of troops for nothing. You have to keep uh, breaking the relocations and breaking these prosperity. That's all for this matchup, guys, and for this week. Wait uh, for us for the semifinals and hopefully for the finals. See you soon.